up, boys, girls, rats, and squirrels? It's Richman here. I'm actually playing now, and my teammate's gonna try to kill me. That's sweet of him. First kill, no, second kill, actually. Hold on a minute, guys, I'm doing something. No! Oh, uh, what is he using? What the? What's up with you? Oh no. <laughs> Sorry, boys and girls. Rats and squirrels. My. I'm not gonna say anything by it, but. Stupid ass. Stupid brother. <laughs> fucking camera. Just pop your legs up on it. That's what I'm doing. <laughs> I just missed terribly. Some straight Everyone down. on YouTube just saw that. <laughs> What? Everyone that just watched this video just saw that. Uh, I don't care. You get locked on to spin out of control. Alright, did. That's a uh, maneuver I've learned. If uh, you spin out of control, well, pretend to spin out of control on Battlefield with a missile locking on you, you can actually uh, live and dodge the missile. What? I, I was gonna ask you something because you've played this way longer than I have, but what? I was gonna say is uh. Is it an upgrade to uh, unlock missiles for your... Yes, it is. Uh, I've tried to shoot missiles. Uh, you want to continue that, continue that stupid moments thing? Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, uh, was it my turn? Yeah, it's my turn. Well, uh... Don't forget to say what you uh, said we should say. <laughs> right in the middle of a vid, I get a text message from a landline that... I got pranked on by someone. Oh, he's on Omegle, and he's just pranking people, and he got pranked back. Mm -hmm. And, uh, he got this landline thing, and, uh... No. They kind of, I, I guess, I don't know, I've never heard of them in my life before, but, uh... They're sending him in a package in three days, and I think he stole someone's package. <laughs> if any of you heard that, we didn't do that, you know, because, you know, we're cool like that. We don't steal. Stay off drugs, kids. Weed's okay though. <laughs> Actually, it, it is because it helps cancer and. Oh, I know. I'm. I was just messing. <laughs> I'm just. Uh, it's pretty good. Oh god. Oh, these <laughs> fox. All they're doing is camping. Oh man. He's camping in the most obvious spot. Why don't somebody just pop a cap in his ass? Back up. Why don't you just pop a cap and beep? I'm going to. Beep. The prod mother. Where's this? But, um, this is actually pretty recently at uh, Sigourney Tool Middle School. Oh my god, the sniper. Um, uh, I was. What the hell? He's, uh, right on the, the radio tower. I didn't know radio damn tower. Uh, yeah. He's up on a damn bridge. But, uh,. 20, 20, 20, 20. I was at school and uh, my ex girlfriend's dating this uh, douchebag named Jordan. And, uh, well, I try my best to get along with him, but uh, it really don't work out too well sometimes. But, basically, what happened was he walked up to me one day and said, uh, I'm pissed at you. And, uh, if, if you're gonna say anything to me, I'm just gonna go ahead and whoop your... And uh, what I've done is I pushed him up against the lockers. And I said, what are you gonna do now? Oh, you're dead. <laughs> oh, what? What did the tank just back off? But, uh... I said, what are you gonna do now? No chance of fighting there. And, uh... Well, my, my ex-girlfriend ran over there and asked me what I was doing. I said I was just rough playing with Jordan. And, uh, I let him go, and he actually took off, I mean, ran, like, like, ran for his life, and he tries to act like a, a hard A, I mean, I'm not joking at hard all. Hard on. Hard ass. Yeah, hard on, trying to act like a, a hard on for his lady friend. Yeah, and I just pushed him up against the lockers, I was like, what are you gonna do now? And he just, he's just a chicken. He said he was his first, uh, uh, he said she, uh, he was his, she, her first kiss, and, uh, I asked Riley if that was true. Oh, crap, I said her name. Uh, she said no. <laughs> Just a little, I'm piece of crap like the rest of them. 
Uh, Jace, you got anything about that? Uh, like, uh, stories, girlfriends in it? Uh, with girlfriends in it? Uh, oh, hold on, let me say one more thing. She's also dating two more guys over the entire summer before I even knew. She, she, she didn't even tell me the whole summer. Now that's bad. That, that, that's what made me mad. I just, whenever I think about that, I've, I literally went the off on her once. I mean, I literally yelled at the top of my lungs. That's what actually gave me 75 points. That's why I can't get in a fight. Oh. I, I yelled at the top of my lungs at her. And, uh, I, it, they, the principal gave me 75 points. Now, this nigga in this T908 motherfucking thing. <laughs> you gonna kiss my ass in a minute, motherfucker. Uh, you got anything, Jace? What? Uh, what, about what I just said, like girlfriends and it. Girlfriends. Like, and uh. Stuff like that. Uh, stories like that, like I just said. Four minutes. Um. Girlfriends thing? I'm thinking, uh. Well. I had a girlfriend once and, uh. She told me she was single and stuff. She, uh. We kissed and stuff. Well. I was walking down the hallway one day. Well, I seen her and another guy holding hands. Well, I didn't say nothing. I was like, oh, well, they're probably just, like, really motherfucker. Really <laughs> good friends. And so I just went along with it that day. Well, the next day I was walking in the hallway, and they and then all I seen was hugging. And then they said, bye, love you. And they was talking to each other. She wasn't talking to me. So... I got pretty mad, started punching walls and stuff, so, like, I'm stupid, so don't be ashamed of me punching stuff, and I've got a temper, so, well, the third day I seen them out in the hallway, they was holding hands, hugging, and kissing, well, I walked up to the guy, and I pretty much grabbed him by his head and just bashed his head into a, to the wall, there was nothing stopping me from doing that. Uh, I'm pretty sure that when I got done with him, his nose was broke, there was blood every- Motherfucker! <laughs> blood everywhere, and that's pretty much the end of my story. That's why if I get in trouble one more time, I get sent to alternative school. Chicks are cold-hearted, man. That's the truth, so anybody out there that's dating a cold-hearted <laughs> bitch... Feel bad for you. <laughs> Seriously, man. And I'm dating a cold-hearted bitch. Well, I'm not gonna say that, but I'm dating a girl that really is always busy and stuff. Doesn't have that much time for me. She sort of uh, upsets me a little bit. She does anime and YouTube videos. She's a bit better. She has, uh, I think, about 30 more subscribers than you, doesn't she? In that area. I think she has over like 100 subscribers. I never, I never knew. I'm just taking an estimate here. You're dead. Um. But, uh, she does anime and, uh, YouTube, uh, she does anime and YouTube videos. You want to give her a shout out of your channel? Uh, she hasn't told me her channel. Uh, well, uh, shout out to her as soon as we learn her channel name. <laughs> shout out to Hannah. Yeah. The hardest girl I've ever seen in my life. Uh. But. Motherfucker. Well, I remember playing Battlefield once. He's a little trick for you in Battlefield 4, if you ever play Battlefield 4. Oh, he's going to try to catch me, son. Um, uh, say if you're in a chopper and you're getting locked up on by a Z11W and you're in a buzzard, uh, basically what my strategy is, is I do a 180, basically uh, kill the engines. Well, basically like I go down as fast as I can. I pull up. And I do another 180, and I just shoot him, because he's trying to follow you, but he can't. I do another 180 and I just, oh crap, camera went off angle, and I just shoot him. <laughs> it's real simple, it's real easy. Move, my pod. Oh, you fucking, oh, I swear this guy's modding so fucking bad. Uh, sorry, boys, girls, rats, and squirrels, this is the end of this episode. Next episode, uh, hope you enjoyed, and, uh, peace.